gorgeous. Hello. Uh, hi, Kanan. What's up, buddy? Hello, sir. Hi, folks. Welcome to Groovin's Day 17 of the year. Wow. Uh, we are going to taste the beer and wine. Yep. And then we're going to rate a beer and wine on their individual scoring ranges. That's right. Yep. So, what do we got, my love? Well, this is Don. I'm Kelly. He's the beer guy. I'm the wine gal. So, let's get to it. All right. Huh. All right, I have Collective Arts Ransack the Universe. All right, I, I have a Life is Too Short to Drink Boring Wine, White Blend from Romania. All right, I think this is kind of like a rebel night here. It kind of is, you know, right? Life is Too Short, Ransack the Universe. Ah! <laughs> yeah, that, was, that was my rebel thing. Uh, yeah. Let's close, let's close, let's close. Alright, uh, all right. Ransack the Universe IPA. Oh. I love that color. That is and something else. That is a great color. It's like a lemon drop. Yeah. Yeah. That is gorgeous. Sure is. You know, pure white uh, head to it. Like, um, this is nice. Oh, it's going to be this Okay. Kind of taking it already. Alright. Try that one. Oh. Hmm. What are you thinking, my sweetheart? Oh. Go. That is, that is, it's a little bit sour. Um, and I wonder if that is. It's like a lemon pucker type of flavor, and I'm wondering if I'm being led by the color of it. Very hoppy, but not dustily so. Let me take you on a journey back <laughs> to the day <laughs> when IPAs first started popping up all over American beer shows. And we tried them, and we thought, wow, this has got a really interesting kind of puckery, bitter taste to it that's, that's refreshing. And then the IPA was. All oh, that delicious bitterness was wiped out in the contest to be the most bitter beer available. This is a simpler time. A simpler time. But an IPA was just nice. Sharp beer. Delicious. I don't know that I can feel this well, that kind of uh, taste journey with this wine. Who knows? We'll see. We'll tell it like my heart. Okay. Not a boring wine. I mean, they're right. It's too short to drink a boring wine. So one of the things that I'm finding on this, you know, this Ruben excursion here for a on is that I have more of a palate for sweet wine than I thought. Okay. Because I'm tasting some wines that are sweet out of the offensive Not meaning I would want to drink my regular or drink glass on the glass, but um And again, I think it's not about color. Beautiful, pale gold. Uh, these colors together. Oh, okay, nice. Yeah. Yeah, um, I, yeah, I just. I don't know that I have the language to speak about it as eloquently as I'd like, but um, it's, it's not a boring line. No, no. It is a little bit sweet. So, a quick story, if you guys don't mind. <laughs> Our very dear Wait, friend. Yeah. Uh, Matt Cleave. Sorry for mentioning your name, Matt, but I'm not giving your social security. From England. Had mentioned that a lot of wines that we think of as very sweet are not developed as sweet wines in Europe and the UK. 
they're actually specifically processed that way for the American palate, sweet palate. Neither the Kelly Ryan has that American sweet palate. That is not a sweet one, but it's sweeter than other stuff I've tasted in this journey. Yes. It's done so well. That's really the crux of it, isn't it? Yeah, it's got a sweetness, but again, you keep saying balanced. It's very balanced. It's it's got a really nice lemony tart balance back to it. Yeah. So not an American sweet. Mm -hmm. And thank you for that tip. That's lovely. I didn't know that I didn't know that. Um thing is, which clearly makes me uh, realize that I need to start thinking about my side of the thing. Rare, but really oh, I honestly, I wish you could see the color. This is cool. So, folks, uh, I think we're ready to rate this. Yeah. How would you? Let's start with the gold. All right. Give that one up. Let's do this. Um, I mean, I'm giving an extra point for helping you discover that sweet wine is actually really good. Mm -hmm. Four and a half. I like what it. What do you think? All right. No, that that Eight. is terrific. And I'm going, going seven five. I think seven five. Which means I gotta kill it. I'm so sorry. All right, so seven four one. I love this so much. Uh, that's freaking great. It's that is so, so good. good. Like the bar, you've had stuff by them before. And it's like, you know, it's got like a leggy kind of skateboarding thing, which is a cool one. Yep. Yeah. Ah, uh, uh, folks, hope you're having a good, yeah. a good holiday season. Until we have a chance to catch you in. That is so good. So it's good. So good.